Rise and Shine East Texas. You're watching KETK Today. And hey, welcome back in. Here's a look at Longview with our tower cam this morning. We are seeing clear skies, temperature of 53 in Longview, dew point of 51. Winds out of the south at 9 miles per hour, so a bit of a breeze out there. You can see it on the flags on top of the buildings. In deep east Texas, though, winds are a little bit lighter, and that has allowed for fog to develop. Visibility is down to 0 miles in Crockett, Lufkin, Nacogdoches, down to 4 miles in center. So if you are in Houston, Trinity, Angelina, Nacogdoches, Shelby, San Augustine, and Sabine counties, uh, you'll want to leave a couple of minutes extra time to get to your destination in case you do see that fog around. And when driving through fog, remember to use your low beam headlights and leave plenty of space between you and the car in front of you. Taking a look at the current uh, weather setup here, we've got a very weak low pressure system over Oklahoma and Texas. This is not going to be impacting our weather. You can see the rain associated with these uh, disturbance well up to our north over parts of Missouri, uh, Illinois and Indiana. So again, no rain for us today. Uh, again, just a few passing clouds, a little bit more in the way of cloud cover in deep east Texas. However, Despite any cloud cover, it's going to be quite warm today with highs in the middle 70s for the most part. We could even see some highs in the upper 70s as well. Cannot be entirely ruled out for your day today. So even though it is the first day of December, certainly uh, will not be feeling like it. And over the next couple of days, we are going to stay on the warmer side of things. Highs in the uh, mid 70s Wednesday, upper 70s for your day on Thursday. Some of us will try to get up to 80 degrees. I don't think we'll quite make it there, but it's certainly uh, possible in one or two locations. We stay in the 70s through the weekend. Big drop for Monday with highs only in the lower 60s. But by Tuesday, we're right back up to 70 degrees. So again, a brief cool down for next week, but uh, not going to make a whole uh, big difference for us. Taking a look at our next uh, rainmaker here. Again, this arrives Friday afternoon, 5 o'clock in the evening. We've got a low pressure system on Friday uh, over the Texas Panhandle. Some showers down to the south of there. We'll see some isolated showers here locally for your Friday afternoon and evening, but expect rain to pick up into the overnight hours as the low pressure system gets closer uh, to East Texas. So uh, Friday night into Saturday looks to have our best rain chances over the next couple of days. And then this low pressure system will weaken when a cold front develops back out towards the west. And then from there, there's a lot of uncertainty as to exactly what is going to happen. So make sure to stay up to date with the latest forecast. Your seven day forecast for us again, very warm for the rest of this week. Rain returns Friday afternoon into your day on Saturday, and then we briefly cool down for Monday, but then warm things right back up for Tuesday for deep east Texas. Again, rain increases Friday afternoon into Saturday. Uh, but again, the main story for today is the fact that it is the first day of December, but it's feeling more like the first day of April. Yeah.